Trees have one job in the biosphere, to absorb carbon. Once trees have reached their peak life, they stop absorbing carbon and slowly leach that carbon back into the atmosphere. It is our mission as responsible stewards of our timber resources to find the older trees that have completed their task, harvest those trees and render them into timber products that bring beauty to the world. And in so doing, allow new younger trees to take their place and begin their job of absorbing carbon. The sustainability of America's timber resource relies on a methodology called selection harvest or selection cutting. By selecting the mature trees, those that have reached their peak life after they've done their job of sequestering all the carbon they can and removing them from the forest, this allows for new growth and it allows for variation in tree height which not only helps the birds and animals but also adds to the nutrient level of the soil. So it fosters new healthy growth while constantly maintaining an ecosystem for animals and birds. As a result of this long-held practice of selection harvest, the United States possesses 9% of the world's hardwood resource, while at the same time satisfying 25% of the world's appetite for hardwoods in flooring, joinery, and furniture. And we're growing twice as much as we're cutting every year, and we have more than twice what we have 50 years ago. We have developed the infrastructure to harvest trees, transport the logs to sawmills, saw and dry the timber for use in projects all around the world while new trees are already growing. So as you look around a park like this, take that in and understand that even if we take a tree out of these woods, new trees are constantly growing we place intrinsic value on the timber grown on the land, whereas in other countries, the value is placed on the reuse of that land for such things as grazing or planting bamboo or palm, which are rapidly renewable crops. This makes a big difference in the way we approach our resource. And when people hear about the timber business, they might automatically assume that we're pillaging the resource. We in the United States do the exact opposite. We've created this wonderful sustainable resource that will go on for generations and generations.